With just minor injuries to show for it, 15-year-old Pemba Tamang tells the story of how he survived 120 hours encased in rubble. When I came to, I was in total darkness, and I realized that there must have been an earthquake. I stayed where I was, turning it over in my mind. The hotel employee survived for five days on just a little clarified butter. The Israeli military who are looking after him are astounded. He came here, he was triaged and remarkably he was speaking with us, he was fully conscious, conscious understood our questions, was able to communicate, uh, doesn't appear to have any major injuries or wounds. The nine-story hotel from which Pember emerged had completely collapsed in Saturday's 7.8 magnitude earthquake. Inspector Lakshman Basnet had to remove his gear to squeeze in and reach the boy. I entered there and talked to him. I gave some water to him and assured him that we are here to rescue you, brother. Don't worry. And he, he was really astonished in that time. And he told me that you are God, you, you God come to me, really please rescue me. As the death toll keeps climbing, it's less and less likely to find survivors of the disaster. And time is running out for the search and rescue teams who are still hoping for miracles.